Sharks have roamed Earth's oceans for over 400 million years, long before dinosaurs ever appeared. Perfectly adapted through countless millennia, these ancient survivors have evolved into some of the most efficient killers in the natural world. The largest and deadliest shark to ever exist was the Megalodon. It is scientifically named Autodus Megalodon, which is a reference to the massive size of its teeth, which are its most defining and well-preserved fossil remains. This colossal shark ruled the oceans from around 23 to 3.6 million years ago. Its sheer size and powerful bite made it the apex predator of the Miocene and Pliocene oceans. The Megalodon was first identified through the discovery of its massive fossilized teeth, which were found in various locations around the world. These teeth, some exceeding seven inches in length, were initially mistaken for petrified dragon tongues during the Renaissance. It wasn't until the late 18th century that scientists recognized them as belonging to an extinct species of giant shark. Fossilized vertebrae later helped confirm the shark's existence and size. The study of these fossils, along with comparisons to modern sharks, allowed paleontologists to estimate that the megalodon could have grown up to 60 feet, which is 18 meters in length. This is equal to the length of two double-decker buses. The megalodon was an incredibly bulky predator, and a typical megalodon weighed up to 65 metric tons, which is about half as heavy as the Statue of Liberty. It was significantly larger compared to other creatures of its time. Early whales like Cetotherium ranged from 15 to 30 feet, which is 4.5 to 9 meters, making them potential prey for megalodon. Marine reptiles like the infamous Mosasaurus were extinct long before the megalodon first appeared, but they reached about 40 to 50 feet, which is 12 to 15 meters, and so were also much smaller compared to this enormous shark. Even other large sharks and marine mammals were typically no match for megalodon size, positioning it as the dominant predator in the oceans during the Miocene and Pliocene epochs. Megalodon was an apex predator that primarily fed on large marine mammals, including whales, dolphins, and seals. Fossil evidence, such as bite marks found on whale bones, suggests it targeted the fatty, nutrient-rich areas like the flippers and rib cages of these animals to immobilize them before going in for the kill. Megalodon likely also preyed on other large fish, sea turtles, and possibly smaller sharks. A single adult megalodon needed to eat around 2,500 pounds, which is 1,100 kilograms of food per day, just to survive. With such an insatiable appetite, they were constantly hunting, which likely contributed to their dominance at the top of the food chain. The most impressive feature of this ancient predator was its jaw and teeth. Fossil evidence suggests that its jaw could open 11 feet wide. This would be large enough to swallow two human adults standing side by side. Megalodon's teeth were truly terrifying. Individual teeth could reach over 7 inches, which is 18 centimeters long. These teeth were serrated, like steak knives, and perfect for making deep wounds through thick flesh and bone. The bite force of Megalodon is estimated to be between 24,000 to 40,000 pounds per square inch. This is strong enough to crush a car with ease and is the most powerful bite ever recorded in the animal kingdom. One remarkable aspect of Megalodon's behavior is how it may have used its immense power and speed to create lethal strikes. The Megalodon had huge, strong muscles in its tail, which generated significant propulsion, enabling it to accelerate very quickly. This combined with its streamlined torpedo-shaped body allowed it to swim at speeds of up to 24 miles per hour, which is 40 kilometers per hour. That is incredibly fast for an animal of such mass. This speed would have allowed it to sneak up on prey and deliver a devastating blow by ramming into them head-on. This was particularly effective for injuring and disabling larger prey such as whales. Fossil evidence indicates that Megalodon had a cosmopolitan distribution, meaning it lived in many oceans around the world. Fossils have been found on every continent except Antarctica. Megalodon primarily inhabited warm, shallow coastal waters and continental shelves, but it was also found in deeper oceanic environments. Some scientists suggest that Megalodon may have used coastal areas as nursery grounds for young sharks, where they could find protection from predators and abundant food sources. A diverse array of marine life existed alongside this formidable predator. Some of the notable animals that lived during this period include marine mammals, such as early whale species like Bacillosaurus and Cytotherium, which were large baleen and toothed whales and were common prey for megalodon. 
Various species of early dolphins also inhabited these waters. Other sharks like Carcaracles and Gustodens, which was a large predatory shark that competed with Megalodon for similar prey. Various species of sea turtles, including the large Archelon, which could reach lengths of over 13 feet. Large predatory fish such as Syphactinus, which was an incredibly fast and formidable predator. Squid and other large cephalopods were also present and likely served as prey for many marine predators, including Megalodon. Other marine invertebrates, including crustaceans and mollusks, populated the ocean floor and water column. This diverse ecosystem provided both competition and food sources for Megalodon, contributing to its status as an apex predator during its reign. Megalodon dominated the oceans for millions of years, but despite its immense size and power, it eventually went extinct around 3.6 million years ago. This is due to a combination of environmental and ecological factors. Firstly, during the late Miocene and Pliocene epochs, significant climate shifts occurred, leading to cooling ocean temperatures and changes in sea levels. This impacted the habitats and prey availability for Megalodon, especially as its preferred warm coastal environments began to shift. As the climate changed, many of the large marine mammals that Megalodon preyed upon, such as whales, also evolved and adapted to the new conditions. Some species became less abundant or migrated to different areas, reducing the food supply for Megalodon. Secondly, Megalodon faced increasing competition from other emerging predators, such as smaller sharks and predatory dolphins such as orcas, also known as killer whales, which may have adapted more effectively to the changing marine ecosystems. These competitors could have exploited similar prey resources, further straining Megalodon's ability to find food. Thirdly, as a large species, Megalodon likely had longer gestation periods and lower reproductive rates. This made it more vulnerable to changes in population dynamics and ecological conditions, potentially leading to a decline in numbers. These factors combined created a challenging environment for Megalodon, ultimately leading to its extinction as it could not adapt quickly enough to the rapid changes in its ecosystem.